What's up, y'all? It's your host, uh, DJ Slate in the building. We got <laughs> Wentz over there. We're uh, coming to you live and direct from the mean streets of Puyallup. Mm -hmm. um, that's where I'm at. Uh, we, we're here with Character You Can't Quarantine Character, hosted by so good. Slater and Wenzel. Shout out to Kylie Mukai out there uh, for the idea. It's a fantastic idea. Uh, we're having a good time. I'm learning how to do this whole uh, live stream thingy. We got a Zoom conference. Uh, yo, Wentz, man, I got some pretty big name people that um, I'm lining up to, to appear on. Uh, uh, character can't be quarantined. Or wait, well, hold up, hold up. That's not what it's called. It's called that, you can't quarantine right? character. What's that? Did we freeze? Oh, did it freeze up? Can you? Oh, hear me? I thought I thought it froze for a second, but I'm good now. Are you talking? Are you talking big time? Like, you know, uh, like John Gordon, big time? Or are we talking? Uh, are we talking maybe more like big time? Uh, like maybe someone like uh, Janea? uh are we yeah. talking you know somebody big time like you know mr cutie himself um i Jacob mean senator are we thinking i i think i think big time is in the eye of the beholder i mean yeah we'll bring in people who that they got a passion for servant leadership we'll put them on the on the uh on the channel here we're trying to create content you know like mm -hmm. we're trying to be content creators right now we are, we are just basically, you know, one thing I actually think is, is that, you know, kind of when things slow down and you don't have as much uh, opportunity to go, 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 I think it really does open up the opportunity for creativity, you know, mm -hmm. and I was talking with my neighbor who's a music teacher and he's like, I'm going to be making music. And, yeah. you know, Abby's always talked about doing like a, like a YouTube cooking channel or something like that. Yep. She's like, maybe we'll actually do it. And she's talking about writing and it's just kind of a cool opportunity to, uh, like you said, create. So yeah. let's, let's do it. Him, let's get them on the show, man. Let's, let's get them on the show and mm -hmm. we'll see what they can bring. Um, yeah. but I figure if everyone's just sitting at home, chilling, doing schoolwork or whatever it is they're doing, housework, I mean, let's, they can take 20 Drinking minutes. Kirkland's signature sparkling water. Yeah. I mean, they can, they, I'm confident that they can, you can't quarantine character. They can get on the show. You know what I'm saying? They can come on the show. Let's bring them mm -hmm. on and let's, let's take, let's take their, their beliefs on servant leadership out for a test drive. Let's see what they got. So, uh, but anyways, we should probably get to the chase. Yeah. Talk a little bit about what we want our kids to be doing this next week or so with the character log. Yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, let's load up the the character log real quick here. I think what do I got on my screen right now? I got my what what can what can we see? I think it's just they can see right now they can see my whole screen. I think let's do this. Let's go boom screen shared boom shagalaga. Ooh, look at that! Um, there we go. Um, all right. So oops, that's not what I want. Let's go here. Boom character goals. They're here. Uh, so you notice at the very top of this work log, we've taken off the work log part because uh, why, why we take that off? I can't remember when it's what we take off work. Uh -oh, log maybe it. because we're not going to school. Oh, that's right. That's right. That's right. We're not at school. So there's no work to do. Um, so, uh, we probably shouldn't send anything out. Right. Cause I mean, if you're not at school, well, mm. you, you know what they say, though, Mr. Slater, they say you can't quarantine character. Oh, mm. It's like it doesn't stop. You try, but you can't. It just doesn't stop. It just doesn't because stop. Character is who you are by the thousands of choices you make daily. Yeah. So character follows you no matter where you are. There you are, which means there's your character. There's your character, man. It's mm -hmm. always on the clock, you know? Yep. So uh, I think that, you know, my hope is that kids will continue to um, converse with their accountability buddy, maybe shoot them a little email saying, these are my mm -hmm. goals for the week. You know, of course, uh, totally. none of this is going to be able to be entered in the grade book. Um, but, <clears throat> you know, one of the things that I, that I think, though, is it doesn't even it doesn't matter. I mean, obviously, when we're at school, we have 
you know, we have some level of uh, investment in uh, providing you a credit, which is a grade, you know, and here it just is like, I guess it's like, does, is it really important to you? And if it is, then obviously the grade doesn't matter. You know, that's one of the things that, that I think is going to be powerful about this is it's an opportunity to, to really show up and, and let your, your actions do the, do the speaking for its value to you, you know? Yep. Yep. So, uh, so let's, let's come up with a goal stand for them this week to, to engage in, you know, my thoughts are, Mm -hmm. um, I think right now there's uh, it's a perfect time for humility, um, to, to take ourselves out of the center of the world. There's a lot, I mean, people right now are, there's a lot of uncertainty. And so they're really having a, you know, I know that kids, I did a check-in yesterday. If, if y'all didn't do that, if you could please fill that out on, uh, on your classroom, uh, that would be really helpful. Just want to know how you're doing. I know many of you out there already did respond, but, um, you know, the, the, point I'm trying to make right now is that like we we got to be like this is a good opportunity to be selfless you know and put take ourselves out of the middle of the world we're all having a sacrifice right now and that sacrifice is pretty significant for a lot of kids I got a student that messaged me talking about Mm -hmm. all of her sacrifice she's made in FFA and you know the hopes and dreams that she had to go to nationals totally dashed um there's, you know, uh, the spring fair is not happening. So she's invested a lot in her lambs and that's not going to have a return on investment. So there's very legitimate things right now that, that kids are struggling with. And so, um, I think it's helpful to think outside of ourselves and to think about ways that other people are also having to sacrifice. And uh, so I think our character goal should center on something like that. So, yeah. So what are your thoughts, Wentz? Well, you talked, I mean, it's, it's just crazy how like, you know, it's all, all the eight essentials are so relevant always, you mm-hmm. know, like you were talking before about uh, what an opportunity for, for patience, you know, self-control and impulse control as we kind of like wait in this uncertainty. Um, but also, you know, I think it is a cool opportunity for selflessness, you know, just the, the, the ways in which you're confronted with, uh, the opportunities that are around you, you know, mm-hmm. um, I, I remember, um, I, I had never been confronted more with my selfishness, my own selfishness than, than when I got married, you know, it was like, mm-hmm. holy smokes came home from our honeymoon. And it was like the opportunities to serve my wife were endless. Mm-hmm. And then same story last, uh, when when we got when we brought home a kid from the hospital it was like yeah. oh my gosh you know and and a and i don't know it just increased my awareness to the mm-hmm. the the needs around me and i think that's something that we could be working on this week is you know um looking at what are the needs uh around us you know and and then looking to meet those needs um and uh I don't know. It could be, you know, emotional needs. It could be the, 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 the task related needs that are around you. You know, Mm -hmm. um, that's something I'm thinking about. It's like just in the, the four days that we've been home, you know, already, uh, with our three kiddos, I'm just looking and seeing their needs for attention, but also the, the needs around the house just to continue to, uh, pick things up and, Mm -hmm. and, uh, you know, sort of, uh, do that you know I had to come outside to avoid the chaos here um, but at the same time you know uh, there's just a lot so a lot yep. of needs that I think right now we can be people who are running towards those needs not running away from those needs you know yep no, I agree I agree with you and and uh, that's the thing we're juggling over here we got our two kids and they're wanting to learn and they need a routine, they need a schedule and we need a schedule and we're trying to figure that out right now. We were mm-hmm. supposed to be going into school on Thursday and Friday. Uh, that's not going to happen now. So remote learning is the future right now for the next couple of weeks. So, uh, mm-hmm. so we're going to make it work for y'all at home. Uh, we miss you. Uh, so let's, let's, uh, let's knock out real quick this, uh, this work log and then we'll let them go. We'll try to, yeah, put it, to put some like, words to it. 
Yeah, yeah. Um, all right, so here we go. Boom, share screen. Boom. So can they be watching right now? Uh, they could if we invited them. We didn't invite them oh, yet. Okay. I'm, I'm not quite ready to have a whole bunch of individuals on the meeting yet. Uh, I think yeah. it, it bogs down the net. I don't know. I mean, I'm not sure. We'll, we'll kind of mess around with some smaller groups maybe and mm -hmm. uh and then we can i don't know as we figure this out we can uh, come up with a solution for how to use zoom but i know that uh, our whole district mm -hmm. i think got it for us so um all right let's cool. go what do we want so there's not a school goal that's out out of the equation because mm -hmm. there is no school so i'm gonna go ahead and we'll now just delete that row boom gone Overall goal is going to be the same um, mm -hmm. that, that it's always been, unless, of course, their overall goal has had something Pertain to do to with school. school. Yeah. Yeah. Um, plus, if, if their goal involved physical contact, probably don't want to engage in that right now. Ooh, so yeah. uh, five high fives, that's out. Uh, you're going to have to figure out a new overall goal. Good opportunity to uh, adapt that right now. But let's go with the home goal since that's where everyone's at. Mm -hmm. All right. This week. At home, I will. Uh, let's maybe we should use the word quarantine. Uh, can't quarantine character, so maybe uh, we should lift the quarantine. Mm. On my character, bye. What are your thoughts on that? <laughs> mm. Do we want to, we probably don't want to mess around with lifting the quarantine that might uh, defy might residential some, authority or, or, yeah, or might send some mixed messages perhaps. Um, I will not allow my character to be quarantined. There you go. Uh, what are your thoughts? I think that's good. Um, and then what, what do you think would be like examples? Um, things that are pertaining to just any of the eight essentials are you thinking about selflessness specifically yeah yeah i think you know like when i think about my own character right now the choices i make this week right now you know my wife and i she's a teacher as well so we're struggling is that with, right like, where does now where does she teach yes yeah, so she uh she's uh she teaches in an ib school um mm -hmm. yeah, it's called sumner high school it's in sumner washington sumner. about 40 sumner. minutes south of seattle Okay. Um, yeah, it's a pretty high profile school. Um, wow. they're pretty big time there. Uh, Is that right? Yeah. So she teaches IB chemistry or chemistry, chemistry, chemistry. Yeah. The CH, right? Yeah. In a, in a Y at the end, it's supposed to sound like an E for some reason, but whatever, that's not here nor there. But, um, so yeah, she, she teaches chemistry and uh -huh. she's trying to do remote learning as well with her kids right. and her husband, you know, he's kind of big time. He, he likes to do like uh, set up his DSLR, his N Nikon mm. D7100, um, set okay. up a nice microphone. So there's only one of those cameras, one of the microphones. Mm -hmm. uh, and so she's really having a hard time with like, all right, when do I get to teach? And I'm like, well, I mean, yes. I'm trying to be on the camera the whole day. And she's like, well, I kind of need to teach too. And then we got our two kids that are like, yo, I want to learn. Mm -hmm. And so I'm like, man, maybe I should step up you know and be mm -hmm. and like maybe let go of the mic and let her yeah let her rock you know rock the mic a little totally bit, you know yep spit that fire um yeah so, so that's a uh, that's i i i want you know maybe what i can do is practice selflessness like i'll i will not allow my court my character to be quarantined by um, setting a schedule where I'm off the mic, I'm off the camera so that she can be on the mic and on the camera. And then I can be with the kids and maybe teach them, you know, meet their educational needs while mm -hmm. she is meeting the educational needs of her students. So that might yeah. be what I would do for my goal language. Um, so set a, an official schedule for daily recording so that we all know when um, so that she knows and I know when we're on the clock with our kids mm -hmm. versus our students. There you go. I like that. I'm trying to think. Uh, one thing that's really important to my my wife is uh, time to work out, and her gym, you know, is closed now. So I'm thinking about potentially giving her time to, you know, uh, break away and and uh, you know go for a run or or find some way to. Um, build that into her schedule but then 
also, like you said, like right now we haven't really started any sort of homeschooling or anything like that yet. Yeah. Our kids are just kind of free, uh, not to do whatever they want, but we haven't mm-hmm. built any schedules. So trying to do something to build a schedule, um, just for that structure that I think is important. Yep. Um, and then we got to move out of our house by the 8th of April. So I'm thinking about that as well to be uh, proactive. I mean, I have more time, I guess now, but um, yeah. so I'll probably write my goal centered around, um, I don't know, maybe my, my wife, I think is a big thing, just kind of care for her. And then maybe we'll work together to build a schedule for our kids too, or for everybody really. Yeah. Cool. Mm-hmm. Well, good stuff, man. Well, let's, uh, let's let these guys go. I'll get this video uploaded to the uh, tube of you. And, uh, yeah. and then, you know, we'll go from there and, and figure out a nice schedule to meet. And maybe if we can get the kids logged onto our meetings, I'm not sure if there's limits or anything like that, but mm-hmm. that should be kind of cool. I want to, I do want to give a shout out here to, uh, B Kings. Um, they're not by any means affiliated with the show nor are they our corporate sponsors, but um, they are pretty legitimate when it comes to meeting your honey needs. Um, they're located in Sumner, Washington. Yeah. They uh, have a really cool logo. Um, I bought it because I love their mm-hmm. fireweed honey, um, which is good. That's really good honey. Um, I think they, they get it from Ellensburg. No, that's not, uh, that's not, that's not connected to, uh, to marijuana, that no. sort of weed. No, no, okay. no. It is a, a, a wild, a wild flower. Um, that is, um, it is, uh, very difficult to have bees that only <laughs> harvest, uh, the nectar from fireweed. So, uh, and it is one of those terms you have to, you have to state it in a way that, um, you know, it's, uh, it doesn't imply any, you know, illicit, yeah. um, um, I wouldn't have assumed that. I just thought I'd better clarify. Yeah, no, I appreciate that clarification. Mm-hmm. Um, but yeah, so Bee Kings, um, they're in Sumner. Pretty, pretty cool. amazing place. Uh, shout out to Addie Rang for pointing that out to yeah. me on where yeah. it's located. So, mm-hmm. okay. All right, y'all. Um, I appreciate this. This is going to be fun. Yeah, it'll be a good time, man. I think uh, we're we're in for some great content. I already have one guest speaker uh i'll give you a little hint um he is a uh a member of the coaching staff of the seattle seahawks so he will be Mm. joining us whenever we can get him on so i'll let you know when i have him lined up i figure all these high profile leadership folks are chilling at home yeah so let's get them on camera totally let's get them on and and get uh get our show um some momentum so all right, y'all. Well, for sure. Uh, thank you so much, Wentz, for taking the time to be with us today. Uh, and uh, let's real awesome. quickly, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just uh, throw this up there. Boom. Don't forget, you can't quarantine character. Quarantine so, character. Cannot do it's it. It's good. All right, y'all. Well, I also uh, like to give a little shout out. <laughs> hold on. Hold on. I got to give a little shout out. This is, this is my neighbor, Connor. Hey, what's up, Connor? Connor? Connor's been can, been peering over the fence, listening in. So we already got a live audience that's that's Boom. growing. Man, we got an yeah. audience. So this is fantastic. Shout out! He heard he heard the whole thing. <sighs> yeah, man. Well, good. Let's give some love to Connor. Uh, our first okay. our first guest. He's our first guest. Yep. Um, mm-hmm. So and then yep. you know next time maybe you could go uh, you could turn your camera sideways, and then we could have a, a horizontal landscape mode for you. You know instead of the vertical mode. Uh oh, I think it's frozen. <laughs> Got too far. Oh uh, yeah. There you go. Okay. Yep. Yep. Turn it sideways. Give us a little horizontal preview. Boom! <laughs> there you are, man. You're almost full screen. Okay. Look at me. Maybe Big this deal. is. Just, yeah, this is it. Look at that beautiful flowering tree it's bush it's in amazing. the background. It's amazing. So yeah, I wonder okay. if bee kings. I wonder if any of the bees from bee kings uh, harvest nectar from it. Yeah, they probably do. Maybe so. All right, Wentz. Well, hey, man, you have a good day. All I'm going right. to go ahead and stop stop the show, and then uh, I will wrap things.